Welcome to Fire Emblem Heroes. Well, right now I'm gonna do for introducing for some feature in this game. So we have fire a uh, friend list. So we can see our friend like this. So he played like nine minutes ago with Camilla here. Five start. Ooh. Okay, I have no idea if I can borrow this friend's hero to for doing some stuff. But I have no idea yet. Okay, so you can check your friend list. You can search your friend list. Uh, you can search your friend with ID. Um, this is the request you sent to your friend. And this one should be okay. This is for the friend request. And this one is remove your friend. Okay. So that's from friend list. Then sometimes your uh sometimes your friends hero come visit you and give you this hero's feather. Wait, hero fe hero's feather? Yeah, hero feather it is un used to unlock potential in allies so about that um, it is on this advanced growth unlock potential so you need to uh, you need to level up, level up your hero to level 20 at least and if it's already level 20 and above well you need to use some Hero's feather and also some. Wait, we can see here. Unlock potential to increase star. Okay, if you raise an ally star rating, you will unlock more of its potential. The ally must be level 20 or higher. You will need specific items. The level will return to 1, but at a higher star rating, it will have raised st stats. And access to stronger skills. Okay. Mm -hmm. You, you will need hero feathers for the one star to three star allies, uh, which you can get in many ways, including the arena battles or pages, uh, which you can get it on the training tower. Okay. Four star allies. Mm -hmm. you need to let you have any level 20 hero then you can upgrade it remember you need some badges and also a lot of feathers then how about merch allies uh, merch allies means that if you have duplicate um, hero you can put uh, you can enhance your your hero like this and you have the other duplicate like this one but I already fused it and I got some SP here like 20 okay mm -mm. okay whoops whoops I accidentally click I mean push the pause button okay mm, what's next mm. level up maybe level up your any Hmm. Here, use the shards and crystal to level up. Okay, uh, leveling up your with items, you can level up your allies by using shards and crystals. Um, shard and crystal types, you must use a type of a shard or crystal that works with your allies type. Universal shards can and universal crystal can be used on allies of any type. Okay. Using shards and crystal shards only needed to needed to L level allies 
that are level 19 and lower uh, crystal using for 20 and above uh, you can get crystal and in the training tower of six centrum or high and higher okay so that's for leveling up your hero okay how to learn your skill so you need a lot of sp like this one i have uh, my virion has 87 sp but right now i'm not gonna use yet until i'm gonna collect 200 sp for unlocking astra it is grants 150 percent to damage deal so your attack right now like on 22 plus 150 percent it should be like um, 22 times 2.5 is it is it right like 50 uh they miss your enemy to two enemies is 55 it seems like it hmm okay i'm gonna save it not now okay equip skills when you want to equip your wait hmm. on okay only zero eight zero stamina use is it oh. okay so you can change your equipment or even your skill mm -hmm. okay generate this change your equip skills equipping skills you can change the skill your allies have equipped for battle active and passive skills some skills are active skill which means that they activate through your action others are passive these take effect effect just by equipping them mm -hmm. so there's three uh so types of active skill three types of active skill weapon assist and special you can use these through your battle action once they are equipped mm -hmm. three types of passive skill miscellaneous a b and c this skill can takes effect after you equip them you can equip more you can equip one skill for each type okay so that's for using this stuff hmm. okay so that's for equipping and I'm not gonna use send home yet it means that converts heroes into heroes feather okay mm. okay so you will get heroes spreader if you want to delete any hero favorite hero mm, you cannot send the ally home or use it in the anyway that results in your losing the the ally the ally permanently he okay. Mm -hmm. the heart mark yeah the heart mark like this one so this one is already already auto favorite because i got this hero all on the four star since you can check it on your settings like here auto favorite for at four star or even five star or even you can off it okay i'm gonna put it on the four star and above Mm, what again maybe you can check your mailbox right now well you can check your stuff here week and login bonus um special login bonus application release bonus okay let's sub sub everything okay this is the present list that i already claimed okay mm -hmm. so this one is missions you need to do this mission in 25 days for this february quest mm -hmm. okay and this one is for the shards and crystals you need to complete everything here but the, the difficulty is still normal it should be there's heart or lunatic 
in the future la later i guess so by the way there's something here it is a requirement you you need to link your nintendo account to your fire emblem heroes you need to link it and you can do your mission here link fire emblem heroes to a nintendo account if you already link it and you will get a hundred a hundred points clear the prologue uh, and you will get another hundred and so on until chapter 9 okay that's for the missions and the rewards here there's universal crystals um stamina potion light blessing dwelling crest and universal shards but i think i'm gonna recommend it with um collecting a lot of universal crystals because you need to or uh, i mean you need to level up your heroes on 20 or above stamina potion it is increase your point one stamina potion for environment fire emblem heroes give 50 stamina okay that's no i'm not done yet but you can see here grand stamina plus 50 restores all dwelling swords oh yeah but that later uh, use during battle restores all ls hp movement and use of special You can do pvp to any player randomly but how to do it this so battle your rifle and earns rewards mm, do a rifle around the world choose your three rifles armies to start a challenge because one dueling sword to battle mm -hmm. how the scoring works if you win you will earn based on your strength of the your foe during a winning streak, you can you will get a chain bonus. The, this bonus will reset after your seventh straight win. Seven straight means seven in row. If it's you, if you lose, well, it will reset. Bit different each these three difficulties so i'm gonna try intermediate this time since i already did a lot of beginner level and i got at the maximum 1367 points after completing seven times win straight win straight okay gonna battle Okay, let's see. Ooh, Lucina. Oh, this is might be bad. Pala. Wait. Four, four, five, three. Okay, it might be okay. Hmm. 
Nah, end my turn. Ooh. She can help heal up. Wait a minute. Turn. No need to worry it yet. Okay, I can take down this. Take down him right now. Um, end my turn. Now. It's only one. Oh, oh, I need to take down Lucina before. Indeed. Before something happens. Yes. Hmm. Yes. Two five. Uh oh. My turn. I need to realize. Ah, uh, it still can kills me easily. Uh oh. Okay. I have no more choices. But at least gonna left her to one HP. Ouch. Mm. Okay, I can take Anna down. Okay, that's and my turn. Uh oh. Sure, I can kill this. I kill her now. Then I can take down this flying hero easily with the archer. It hits 25 and boom. Well, that was intermediate level or in the in the arena. Okay, so I'm lucky, maybe, I'm just scared with any 5 star unit, I mean 5 star heroes like this one, so I win, I got, wait, chain bonus plus 310, okay, so that's for the arena, hmm, and there's also special maps like this one. Hmm, Elite Archer Firion. Ooh, so I can get him. Hmm. So only one star, right? For a moment. So you need to victory this map with four survivors if you lose one and... And the mission will be failed. Hmm. Okay. Let's go. Gonna try again. Gonna try this. I haven't tried it yet. Fear in the elite archer. Okay. Ooh. Indeed. Yes. No, I'm not gonna risk it. Quite so. Okay, gonna take down this cleric first because this one can heal enemy uh heal her allies. So yeah. Hit seven. Hit her. Eighteen and she's done. Uh oh. Hits only zero, I'm okay. Ow. That's good. <laughs> uh oh. That's the boss. <laughs> but yeah. Only oh, I'm only using one unit. I'm I mean one hero. It's already more than enough. 
Wow. Okay. Mm, you will you will earn less exp on this map since you already clear it okay so i'm not bothered to do it that again seven at, at fence grow so i like this right so i enhanced four star and i'm losing the one star so i will get 10 sp okay so I get more S more SP. I need more SP. Inherit. Okay, so 110 SP. So I need 90 more to upgrade. To learn the skill, the new skill. Wait, is it done yet? Well. So so far right now I only tell you all about that first. The, for the rest one. Well, for the training tower and the other one is not unlocked yet, so I'm gonna do the story maps on other video. Okay, so thank you guys for watching this video, this Fire Emblem Heroes, and see you again next time. Bye bye.